Hi, I'm Kylie, and I hate coffee as much as I hate everybody else. Estimated that people consume a staggering 120,000 tons of caffeine each year. Today, coffee is grown in dozens of countries and several varieties are known for their distinct flavors. 76% of children ages 6 to 17 in the United States consume coffee daily. Different types of brews of coffee have different caffeine levels. Decaffeinated coffee has 1 to 5 milligrams, espresso has 100 milligrams, and regular coffee has 40 to 180 milligrams of caffeine. My favorite is like a frappuccino coffee. From where? <laughs> Starbucks. <laughs> I like Dunkin'. I love coffee. It's like how I survive. I can't wake up in the morning without it. Okay, I'm Jess Jewel. I'm from Manitoba. Red Bull. Um, the addiction's real. <laughs> Probably drink it every day. I'm Mrs. Million, the school nurse at Haggis Town High School. And we're talking about caffeine drinks in teenagers and energy drinks in teenagers. Um, since caffeine is a stimulant, energy drinks and caffeine, caffeinated beverages as Coke, coffee should be limited in students. It decreases your energy level as you um, drink too much, it gets you worked up and then your energy level will drop. I don't need coffee. Oh, I do. Like if I'm really tired, if I didn't have enough sleep, like I'll have it, but like I won't have it every day because it's not. Like, I mean, I will come to school late with coffee. I feel like when you come to school late with coffee, like people judge you. Yeah. Like when you go to class, people are judging. Because they know what you're doing. People who don't like drink coffee in the morning, like normally, I don't know how they get into bed. I don't like know. I don't know how I survive without coffee. Cause like before I could yeah, drive, like I, I was perfectly coffee. fine before yeah. I started drinking coffee. Like I started drinking coffee like a second ago. Yeah. And now like it's a necessity. But like before, like you have to get used to coffee. Yeah. So like, like it can do some bad stuff to you. If you know what I mean. Okay, uh, Duncan. Quick check. Quick check has some good French vanilla cappuccinos. They're delicious, and if I didn't have co if coffee didn't exist, I would not be awake ever. I would be sleeping forever, all the time. Oh. I usually have about four Red Bulls a week. I usually drink them before work because it keeps me awake. Because you can't drink coffee like later in the day. Like coffee is reserved for the morning, and then Red Bull is like the evening and afternoon and nighttime drinks. Red Bull's really unhealthy for you. Coffee's healthy for you. It doesn't do anything to her anymore. Well, yeah, it, it really, I'm immune to the Red Bull. Um, it used to keep me really focused, but now it kind of just hyper. I'm very against having these monster drinks. They're just very unhealthy. Hello, my name is Ben. I enjoy drinking Monster Energy drinks almost three times a day after every meal. And I feel like it gives me magical energy powers. Caffeine helps people stay awake, enhances performance on mental tasks, improves hand-eye coordination, speeds up reaction time, and boosts energy for muscular work, including sports and exercise. Before they get their coffee, they're like evil, and I feel like a lot of people depend on it these days, like their caffeine high. Caffeine can also cause adverse reactions that are more serious than the jitters. Problems can include dizziness, rapid and pounding heartbeat, extreme restlessness, anxiety, digestive turmoil such as cramps, nausea, vomiting, confusion, and even seizures. It's the grossest thing I've ever witnessed. I say no to coffee. 